Today on Soundcheck with Kronos, we're going to take a look at my Tom Anderson Raven Classic. Let's get started. So my first introduction into Anderson Guitar Works was at a shop called Danville Music out in Northern California when I lived there. Previously, I'd never even heard of the brand, uh, nor had I ever played one of their guitars. So when I walked into Danville Music, they had a couple on the wall that didn't really appeal to me. They were kind of super strat-like, but uh, the guys down there said they had a couple of really cool kind of vintage-inspired uh, guitars that I would probably enjoy, and they would give me a call as soon as they came in. And so a couple weeks later, I got a phone call from them at uh, Danville Music, and they told me that they had this really cool offset Jazzmaster-like uh, black over fireman's gold, uh, they call them the Raven. And I was very intrigued because I never played an offset guitar before Shocker. I, I'm a big Strat and Les Paul guy, uh, never really played offset guitars, so I didn't know what to expect, so I went down to the shop. Um, immediately fell in love because they know that I'm a sucker for anything gold with gold hardware um, and this is black over fireman's gold which I have a gold top in the corner it matches really well with um, just gold hardware just something about it just gets me you know um, plugged it in immediately felt comfortable the tones that came out of this thing were absolutely sublime and I thought eh, it's a little bit relic so I won't mind gigging this amp and using it as like a session tool um, yeah so here it is. So let's talk specs really quick because this is a very interesting, very, very interesting guitar. So first the body, it's Swamp Ash. So it's an incredibly light body. We have a 25 and a half inch scale length. So super comfortable for me with a caramel maple kind of medium C neck. It's a very, very thin C, uh, C neck shape. It's very comfortable, very fast. The caramel maple is super smooth. Uh, the front ends are incredibly rounded over and very, very nice to my palm. Anderson branded locking tuners, a buzz feet and tuning system. Um, and this trem just stays dead in tune no matter what you do with it. Even like dive bombs, um, it'll actually stay in tune. So what really caught my eye about this guitar was I don't have a P90 guitar in my arsenal. And I saw these and they don't really look like P90s. They look like mini humbuckers to me a little bit, but they're P90s, they're PH1 and PH3 Anderson um, pickups. And they're kind of the noiseless P90s, which my big complaint with P90s was I could never play with overdrive because it would hum like a mother. Um, but this has noiseless humbuckers and they sound fat and glorious. And the thing that really got me was these two toggles down here. These are tone cut circuits. So it makes it sound not Strat-like, but very kind of clear, pristine. It cuts all the low-end mud out of the equation. So that really did appeal to me. So let's now get into the sound clips of the Raven Classic. Today, I will be playing through my Nailer Superdrive 100 um, in a 4x12, um, mic'd with an SM57 directly into my interface. Uh, with literally nothing on it but a tiny little bit of compression from an 1176 style compressor. Um, so, hope you enjoyed this video. Hope you enjoyed the Raven Classic. Uh, links to Tom Anderson's website will be down in the description below. And I'll see you in the next video. Peace. <laughs>
Thank <laughs> you.